What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Stone. I'm back. Oh, y'all can't even see the muscle for real. Yes, it's back with another video and before i even get started on this this wasn't even the original video i was going to post i have been hard at work at trying to upload a new style of video i have uh that I recorded my big sister and my computer may or may not have wiped itself clean of all my shit on it so yeah i had to get a new computer well not even new, i had to get my shit fixed pretty much but like an hour and a half to get it fixed um so yeah that's why there was a lack of videos and also with that being said when it wiped this stuff it wiped it of every piece of data on my computer so it's been an absence of videos and i apologize so i am back with today's video uh if you think i'm reading a script by the way i'm not i'm looking at my phone camera i don't have my actual camera camera it has no storage on it right now um yeah using my phone camera also just better quality anyway and i'm looking at myself when i'm talking but i have to get used to like looking at like the actual camera but uh yeah nah so with that being said i have this childish gambino uh diss track this is a very unplanned video that's why i'm kind of all over the place i was not planning for this at all uh my boy actually just texted me not too long ago talking about some yeah did you know childish gambino diss drake really mr gambino <laughs> donald glover <laughs> really <laughs> okay so yeah, uh, obviously I know they don't have the best friendship at all. Uh, they don't have a friendship at all, actually. But um, yeah, nah, I didn't you know listen to his album until today, actually, and just you know, perfectly timed. My boy texted me about it. I was listening to it today, actually. But um, yeah, nah, I was told that this was actually a Dej Dr I was told this was a Drake diss track, and you know, I gotta see what's going on. I gotta see what's going on. Now, there probably will be people on here again. I just spit everywhere on here again that are so mad about mad at me for, you know, liking the music that I like, which is insane to me. Y'all are so concerned about what another grown man likes. It's a little bit weird to you, but hey, that's not really the premise of today's video. The premise is to see what we talking about here, okay? I want to hear what Childish Gambino brings to the table for the distance today, okay? So hey, without a further ado, it's your boy Stell. <laughs> Let's get out and shout. There's no music video, so we're gonna watch the obviously the audio. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make sure this is turned up for y'all. That's my brother, don't you know it? I stuck around like yo, she know it. Stone Mountain Reed and the cast of coil. This my life, I must enjoy it. This my life, it busts for it. We don't hold back, we must move forward. Stay where you at, you're supposed to, boy. Niggas is fake, I won't ignore it. I put your boy in the seat, you got your business streets. I wash my hands when I eat, I never handle the key. I don't know no one BD, but they depended on me. Niggas don't know where I'm at. I find your house on the app, people around you ain't flat. They plotting hard when you flat, they got a gun in your back. This who you trust when you sleeping at night. I'm in the mirror, I see what I like. It is what it is, I'm right when I'm right. Fuck with my kids, you fuck with your life. You fucking these hoes, I'm fucking my wife. They can't not silent like knife. Think you won't do it, I might. I gotta do what I like. I gotta I'm late. I was mesmerized by the flow in the hard ass beat. <laughs> that boy is floating right now. <laughs> boy is floating this nigga obviously did want all the smoke with drake i am already looking forward to what drake's comeback is going to be to this if he does come back and we know drake doesn't does take a lot of shit personally so he's going to come back with something is it going to be a diss diss track i don't know uh but i can see him probably throwing a shot for sure at his next song that he drops um when I heard it was a Drake diss track, I thought it was actually going to be like, I mean, I thought you could pretty much tell it is directed at Drake, but like coming off the beef, I was expecting a name drop, of him calling him like BBO Drizzy or some shit, or Drizzy Drake, some Aubrey, six God, freaky ass nigga, he is six nine God, something, but I'm only also like not even a full minute in, so let's get it. I'm going to just, let's get it. I want to hear the whole thing in his glory. That's my brother, don't you know it? Super Ellen Young from Yo, she know it. Stone Mountain Reed and the Castle Boy. This my life, I must enjoy it. This my life, they bust for it. We don't hold back, we must move forward. Stay where you at, you're supposed to, boy. Niggas is fake, I'm on it. This is a cold 
Code red for old heads who never liked my short shorts and pro kids. Been a minute since he had to fit it on a notepad. I was busy building up the life that niggas don't have. Told me that the money make you lonely, it ain't so bad. Niggas jokes are so dad, but haven't seen their son in a month. Sold some apple stock to buy a farm, I needed to stunt. I told him take the back end points, he wanted the front. Now his career's in a blunt. These rappers cosplay the industry, Comic Con, the industry, evil people. Me and fam got a trauma bond. Drive like the Audubon, integrity whore. Say what I mean, apologize if I didn't. Or clarify if it's written in stone. Freak it and leave it alone. Give it time, let the truth come to light. Let them catch up. Niggas peeping like, damn, he was right. Rather have my foot on their neck than they hand on the mic. Rather die as a good man with a bad wife. These niggas almost 50 and they dressing like a hype beast. Used to get the peach milkshake and add the eight piece. White boy throwing dirt on my name for the think piece. Checks off, death, murder, and pain leave you empty. I curse you with that knowledge. Put their hands on a woman for the clout, but said I'm wildin'. Death before the sauna on my mom like Kiki Palmer. I'm allergic to the drama. You saw me and Tyler. I'm allergic to this rap shit. Made a song, but spent more time writing the caption. I'm an actor, you can put that on set. I'm about that action. My tweets all lowercase, I saw these niggas capping. My homegirl said she was stalker, so we ain't dapping. I ain't see you, man, what happened? Man, the blog era overtaking all our stars. My favorite spot was about to close, so I made some calls. Bitch, nigga, eat a dick and doggy bag the balls. This nigga is spazzing. Is it that deep? <laughs> is it that deep? Was this, is this all directed at Drake? <laughs> I'm only confused because I know, um, I really do not know the history of like their, their issues with each other. The only, the most recent thing I've seen was that he, um, Childish Gambino had went on, I think it was a GQ or what is it called? What the fuck is that place called? GQ? CG? Y'all know the little interview news thing, y'all. Y'all know what I'm trying to talk about. I seen he had went on there and, um, damn, what was it? I have terrible memory. I just know he had something to say about Drake and can't remember if it was like inherently really that bad per se, but I know when he said whatever he said, Drake on his, um, I think it was, it's all a blur tour, had put in a giant like screen shit, usually have words on them, whatever those are called, the screens, and said, um, something about 3005 was overrated, or some shit about Childish, I know they have issues, I just don't know how far back it goes, and I don't know how deep it is, if this is all directed, if that entire second part is directed at Drake, obviously it must be deep as shit, okay, <laughs> because it, from what he was saying, it seemed like he was talking to Drake, talking about how he might be fucking all these girls, you know, he's fucking his wife, shit like that, like, you know, act, actor working on his captions more than his rapping like he was going in like god damn drake what did you do bro? what did you do oh, shit it's at the end of the song You've never heard of Shaka Khan? What are they teaching you in school? I hope that wasn't copyrighted from like a show or some shit. And then he links 2005 as the singular only video to pop up. <laughs> Yo, that was hard. That was hard. That nigga went in. <laughs> Drake, I gotta do some research to see what the hell happened because he was going in. Uh, I can't remember the last time I actually heard Childish Gambino rap his ass off like that. He was rapping, rapping. Like he said, I'm allergic to the rap shit. Shine, you need to be rapping more. <laughs> what the hell? Listen, I like Drake's music, but y'all, y'all, anybody who actually watches my videos and doesn't, you know, come to a conclusion within the first 10 seconds and leaves a, na a mean comment, a nasty comment about me liking Drake, y'all know I'm a Drake fan of, I'm a fan of his music. Let's get that settled. I'm a fan of his music. He was going in. like I got I gotta really um sit down and look at why they're beefing, what the exact issue is. Because if he was rapping like that against him, where were you at during the beef? 
all that all that good music they were dropping uh, where are you at the beef Donald Glover god damn um now in all seriousness I don't know if he's gonna actually if Drake's gonna actually like respond respond um we've seen in the past that like sometimes like he he won't respond fully he'll just throw shots at people in um in his songs but since this seemed like it was entirely directed at drake there was never a name drop i was i was low-key feeding for a name drop i was feeding for a name i wanted to see him call out drizzy drake (laughs) but um he didn't god damn it but i feel like it's kind of obvious who was meant for so i feel like i feel like when you make the diss obvious who it's meant for you don't really need a name drop because like the person everybody's gonna know who it's for and you specifically are gonna know it's for you um that was like my argument when like people were saying that drake was scared to name drop i feel like well obviously we've seen against kate uh kendrick he was not scared to name drop i think it was name dropping every single diss he dropped but um i think uh, i remember kanye said in an interview that when drake disses you he'll make it in a way that only you'll be able to know that he's he's you only you know he's dissing you the entire other like the entire audience won't know he's dissing you but you yourself you'll know he's dissing you I, that was my argument against that too where it's like well if he's making a diss and making it in a way that only you know is directed at you it's getting it's getting the message across that hey i don't fucking like you so like can you really call it sneak dissing if he's making it directly at you and i feel like the same thing here where it's like he didn't name drop, so you can't really call it a sneak diss, but like he made it obvious who, who it was about. Now, obviously, he made it in a way that everybody goddamn knows who it's about, which is a little bit different than how Drake does it, but it's the same principle that like they're making it so you directly know it's about you without having a name drop. And I feel like, like I said, he didn't need a name drop. He obviously was about P. Drizzy. God damn, that point went in. I, I'm taking it back. I haven't really, um, whatever his last album before this was, um, I, did, I listened to it, but I didn't, like, it didn't really capture me, and it's not because I don't, I think Childish Gambino is actually a great, amazing artist, it's just his music really isn't for me, per se, but, um, some of his songs I do really, really like, like, I love 2005, my favorite song, Sweatpants, Masterpiece, all of that, um, what is that shit called, Before the Internet, damn, what is that album called, it's his old one when he's looking at the camera like this that one i have terrible memory i haven't even listened to the album in like years actually but yeah that album i thought was really good uh i love rapping childish gambino the the newer stuff he was doing i wasn't really the biggest fan of but like i said it wasn't my type of music i didn't think the songs were even bad it's just it wasn't for me but uh i could acknowledge when music is good if um so yeah this is the childish gambino i love but he's rapping he's like he could actually rap like i i guarantee you i promise you if he actually just rapped all the time he would out rap 90 percent of rappers nowadays 90 percent of these niggas are ass and he would definitely out rap 90 percent of them as we can just see like this alone is better than some rappers entire catalog i'm not gonna hold you but uh enough with the childish gambino blazing okay i just had to give i just put some respect on his name childish gambino donald glover actor comedian rapper that's what issue what he do he nasty like that but uh yeah now over i thought it was a great diss ah shit that boy was going in um i'm curious to see how drake's gonna respond if he responds to the actual song on his next album if he even drops the album this year which i won't be surprised if he does he usually does around like what october september so yeah, we'll see in that time frame if he responds with an actual song but he'll do it like he did and he'll respond um he'll respond without name dropping but the entire song be about Charles Gambino or he might fuck around and just name drop him drop name drop him after the Kendrick beef I don't want to see Drake name dropping everybody bro every everybody who this has to be name dropped because that's so tough I love a rapper's name drop but uh you know, I'm curious to see how he's going to respond. But hey, with that being said, this video will be pushed out immediately. It's 1030 at night, which is not normal average time. It'll probably be out by 11, probably. But uh, yeah, now with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys have a good morning, good afternoon, good night, whenever you're watching this. And I will see y'all later. Peace.